This morning, we're getting a better sense of what the 2024 presidential race might look like as both President Biden and likely Republican contender Ron DeSantis took aim at former President Trump on Saturday. NBC's Monica Alba has more from the White House. Monica, good morning. Willie, good morning to you. That's right. On Saturday, President Biden delivered the commencement address at Howard University, a historically black college here in Washington, where his message to graduates reflected his reelection themes, speaking out against politicians who stoke division as well as white supremacists. The fearless pride, progress toward justice often meets ferocious pushback from the oldest and most sinister of forces. That's because hate never goes away. Meanwhile, in Iowa, Florida, Governor Ron DeSantis was previewing his own likely campaign message while taking indirect jabs at the man who may be his top GOP rival in the 2024 race, former President Trump. We must reject the culture of losing that has infected our party in recent years. The time for excuses is over. We got to demonstrate the courage to lead and the strength to win. Now, Mr. Trump was scheduled to hold a rally in Des Moines last night, but had to cancel due to a tornado warning. And the former president hasn't held back from slamming the governor, his one-time ally, who's been laying the groundwork to launch his own White House bid any day now, with some staff expected to move into a new political headquarters tomorrow. The clearest sign yet he's about to enter the race formally, since that decision will trigger federal election paperwork in the next 15 days. Willie? Things are about to get a lot more interesting. Monica Alba at the White House. Monica, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.